Back in Time at the Oshkosh Speed Zone is sponsored by Everlasting Living Memories. Everyone has a story to share, filled with a lifetime of memories and milestones to be remembered. What a wonderful and affordable gift for you and your loved ones, all recorded on film. Everlasting Living Memories can help you go back in time to express the love you felt on your wedding day, or the birth of your child, or the passion you had for your career or hobbies. Everlasting Living Memories, making lasting memories for all generations. For more information, call 920-410-4379 or visit EverlastingLivingMemories.com. Had problems and Jim didn't make the call either in the 44. But right now, it's future time. Free play. Here they go. Look at them. Three, four, five wide through the lot two corner. They can do it because they're just little devils, devil devils, those dirt devils. Here they come, lap number one. Nick Goldman in the six. Here leader after a lap. Stegner in the eight. In that runner-up spot, Tony Fletcher. Showing in third in the 27. They are really mixing it up back there from third on back. Coming to lap number two. Look at him, mixing it up. Go, leader. Stegner wanting to take that spot in the eighth car up to the high side. Third spot, the 22 of Gilbertson. Car comes Chris Moss. Chris Moss is coming it's up to fourth. Bangered in the top five hole. Watch out, Stegner, the second place car. He was looking at the infield guy there for a second. He had that car turned totally sideways. Drives back out of it, hangs on to the second position. One fourth the distance. Goldman still hanging on to the lead. He's got company coming. Stegner in the eight, charging back up there. Gilbertson in the 22. Chris Moss in the 7M, and Sean Banger down the move in the four. Another lap complete. Mr. Fairbank in the sixth in the 10 half. Cody Tankow is going to the yellow machine. The 7P working to the front. All bunched up the top six up front there. Doing a battle for that lead. Wanting to get that lead away from Nick Goldman. Goldman, he's got company. He's got five guys wanting to take his lead away from him. Through the one, two, four. <laughs> Continuing on. Look at this action up front as we come to complete lap number nine. They're going to be putting a lap on the 39 of Van Oyen here shortly. Three wide almost for the lead. What's going to happen? Goldman, Eichner, all going at it for that top spot there. Coming up on that 39 car. Going to put Van Oyen a lap down. All working around that machine. Halfway, 10 in, 10 to go. Good racing out of our dirt devils. Give them a chance to put on a show and they'll do it every time. New leader now. Defendant champion. Oh, trouble. Couple guys getting together. We got another one on its lid. Goldman gets turned over. Oh my goodness. Third rollover of the night. Rick says I've been buying a beer all night. That's the least they could do. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah. All righty, we're, we're cleaned up, ready to get back at it. 
We thank you people for your patience. This three year old overs tonight. What's going on with that? Let's pray for no more of that stuff. All right, back to racing. Here we go back at it. Sean Banger, our defending track champion. He's out front by a couple car lengths. Over to John Stegner. Chris Moss is right there in the 7M in that third spot. Cody Payne call right there. Julie Fairbank in the top five. Lumwitz, Gross. Amish Coleman back there at the 23. And Joe Minx all in that group just out of the top five. They're all battling sixth through ninth. Complete lap number 12 this time by. Down the back straight away another time. Lots of close racing going on. Through that one two corner onto the back stretch they go. Close racing going on here down the back straight away they go the top two breaking away from third place Stegner a little bit. Oh we've got caution we got something on the back stretch. Fourteen laps in. Six laps to go for the Dirt Devils. Come on. Green flag. Get back underway, Banger. Up front, Chris Moss. Next in line, trying to get that top spot. Little teammates going on here. They're battling. For that lead, Stegner hanging in there. All that silver machines up front. Cody Payne going for in fourth, rather. Then the 77 of West Longwood's your top five. Four to go now. Down the back straight away, working hard there. That's still a good battle going on for that lead. Moss trying everything. Trying to get by that four car of Banger. They're pretty evenly matched here. Moss. Drifting her way up to the high side. Trying to get on up there and challenge. Now looking to the inside of Sean Banger. Here they come. Putting the heat on. We'll have two to go. Banger. Moss not giving up. Last green flag left. On the back stretch another time. Battle for fifth back there between Fairbanks and Longwoods. Joe Minx right there. One more time around. Sean Banger wanting to pick up one of them big Kim Parsons Memorial trophies. Into the three-fourth corner, and here's a checkered flag. Who's going to get it? It is close, but it was Sean Baggard in the fourth. Edging out the seven of Chris Moss. Stegner in the eighth, the seven of Cody Pankow. Mitchell Lee Fairbank in the 10F, your unofficial top five. Mark Howe, your pole sitter in the three. Andrew Meyerhofer alongside in 14. Corey Wagner in 19. Adam Peshek in the white and blue 66. In that second row, give him a wave. Being paced by the Bergstrom GM automotive group truck. 
Wyatt Block in the two junior, Colton Van Heerden in 66, Brian Besaw in the 10, Kevin Pesky in the 09, Tom Schneider in 98, John Schultz in the 11X. There he is out of the car down there. Another nice hand for Sean Baggard, everybody. Hard charger out of Chilton. Superman Jeff Schmull in his 11S. Chase Randerson in 56. Todd Ewald in 57. Scott Johnson in a 76. Tim Shepard 29. Jeff Steenburgen in a 62. Mike Dufina in 65. Jason Ebert in 72. We're going racing. Sean Johnson back there in the four. And Bernie Miller in the double zero. Underway, here we go. Oh boy. Look at them bunching up up front. Oh no. Watch out. <laughs> Trouble down on the inside there for Black. Got over one of the tires there in turn three. Out front, Mark Howe in the three. Adam Peshek in the 66. Doing battle for that top spot. Peshek into the lead now. Corey Wagner on the move in the 19W. That bright green machine into second spot. Racing out. Oh, we got one turning around. Besky in turn three. Kevin Besky loop with a 0-9 in turn three. Let's go racing! <laughs> Sounds like a plan to me. Two laps in, 18 to go. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. They're mixing it up over in the corner before the restart already. Oh my. Caution back out. Let's go back racing. That's what Brianna says. That's what I say too. Let's try it again. Great play. Back underway. Here we go. Oh, watch them three wide for the runner-up spot. Wagner, How, Besaw, 66 of Adam Peshing, your leader. Three laps in through the one-two corner out of the back straightaway another time. Pashik by about three car lengths. Brings them on back past the grandstand. No, we got one backwards in the three-four corner. Hardware on the line here. They are battling and fighting and mixing it up. And oh boy, we got to get going here. We got a lot of racing to get done yet. All right, let's try it again. Back to green. Patrick leads him out of the one two corner. B saw right there with him. There comes that other 66 of Colton Van Heerden. He wants to make it two in a row here at Oshkosh. Wyatt Block on the move. Tom Schneider in the 98. Closing on up there in fourth. This time by will have six laps in. Down to the inside. There comes the tenor, Ryan Bisson. He your new leader now. Taking that top spot away from Adam Peshek. Colton Van Heerden right there well, as well. The battle of the 66s side by side for second. Tom Schneider in fourth. Wyatt Block in the top five. And then it's Superman in his number 11, Jeff Small.
side by side for that top spot. Here comes Colton Van Heerden wanting that lead. The ten of Bisaw still in charge, but not by much. Van Heerden looking to the inside. In the meantime, the 98 of Tom Schneider gets by the 66 of Peshek and up to third. This time by, we're halfway, 10 in, 10 to go. Battle going on for that lead. Van Heerden wants the top spot. He saw it, doesn't want to give it up. That's what the dandy. Going at it, neck to neck, back, 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 back out front to 10. Van Heerden trying to fight back again. But he saw it now by a car length. Tom Schneider showing in third. And it's Adam Pashik in the 11 of Jeff Schmull now into the top five. Getting by the two of Wyatt Block. Laps clicking away. Seven remain. Sport mod feature. Six, or the 11 rather, of Jeff Schmoll. Moving up another spot, getting by the 66 of Adam Peshek. Oh, and now they get together in turn number three. Oh. Schmoll passes Peshek, Peshek tags Schmoll and spins him in turn three. Bull recovered to keep on going, and he's not a happy camper. Ryan Besaw, his dad's truck and car during the trophy tour. He's hoping to take home that hardware. We'll see what happens. Back to green. Back at it. Oh, boy, watch Ben Heerden way up in to the high side of the one-two corner. Trying to get a bite up there and he lost a little bit of ground. Tom Snyder into the rough, rough spot. Two to go. Oh, scoreboard's wrong. I stand corrected. We've got more laps to go than I said. Five to go. And another caution is up. Uh, scoreboard is getting ahead of itself there. <laughs> I apologize. The top spot in that car. Now starting at the tail. We're getting back racing. Ryan B. Saw, Wyatt Block. Colton Van Heerden, and from the last chance race, Jeff Steenburgen, the 62 car up the board. And we've got a mess in turn four now. Oh my. Let's see if we can finish this one up. Green play. Back at it we go. Lieutenant Ryan B. Saw. The two junior Wyatt Block. Colton Van Heerden in the 66 C. Jeff Steen Virgin in the 62. John Schultz in the 11 X, your top five. Down that back straightaway. Schneider down onto the infield. Keep things going. Two to go. B-Saw, Van Heerden, block. Steve 
Bergen and Schultz. Oh, and we got a spin up in turn number one. Time limit is run out. Checkered flags in the air. This one's complete. And Ryan Besaw will take home uh, a Kim Parsons Memorial Trophy Tour Trophy. Getting ready for more race and action here. Total power sales night at the races. It's time for our automotive supply company, IMCA modified feature. Adam Reed, your pole sitter in the 89, next to TJ Smith in 69. Mike Mueller in the 3M, Chad Bartell in 81. Matt Clens in the 18, Chris Angles in 29. We'll have Jerry Munster in 79, Mike Clens in 17. Tim Robbins in the 451, Dan Radle in 33X. Eddie Munster in the 5, Johnny the Hitman Whitman in 08. John Schultz in 37, Kevin Feck in the 21. Tim Lemeron in 5X, Marcus Yari in the 58. Jeremy Christians in 99, Sean Jervitz in the 37. Steve Schneider in 21S and Mike Whittlestat in the 77. And already a caution before we even get things started. All righty. Let's see if we can get this one going. How about a to checkered modified feature? Let's do that right now. Here we go, underway through the one, two, everybody making it through there just fine, down the back straight away. T.J. Smith, your early leader in the 69. Out of turn number four. Mike Miller, Adam Reed, Chad Bartell, three car battle for second place. Monster on the move. Oh my, trouble on the backstretch. Marcus Yard getting turned around the opposite way. Lining up the rest of the field back there. Oh, there. Jack Rabbit starting back there again. Oh, my. I could swear that it must be a full moon tonight, but it's not. our fingers and our toes and our eyeballs. Let's see if we can get this one done. Green flag. Back underway, TJ Smith back up front in the 69 over the three of Mike Miller. 29 of Chris Angles in that third spot. He's being challenged. Here comes the 81 of Bartell right up the middle. Oh, and we got trouble at turn two now. Lemeron gets turned around.
place your bets at the window. Are we gonna get some more racing in here? All right, let's try it. Green flag. Back underway, Smith's up front in the 69 over the three of Mike Miller. Here comes the 81 of Chad Bartell, charging hard on the high side. 29 of Chris Engels in the mix there. That's the 18 of Matt Clens. Tim Robbins in the 451. Three wide. Next back there. DJ Smith in charge. Mike Mueller knocking on the door in the 3M. Watch that battle back there for about 7th through about 14th right here. Look at this bunch. Oh boy. Top four breaking away. Smith, Mueller, Bartell, and Engels breaking away from Robbins and the rest of the bunch back there. Zigging and zagging as their position. Bartell on the high side. We've got one crossed up in turn three. Now well, we got a few more laps in, but now we've got looking like is that the 21 effect over there? underway TJ Smith leading the field down the back straight away Miller Bartell side by side for the second spot and Jervitz got a race going on for force Tim Lemeron he's the problem <laughs> tonight he's there in the top five coming to lap number nine with six to go Change up front, it's still TJ Smith, but he's got a challenge from the 81 of Chad Bartell. Chris Engels in the third spot. Mike Miller to the high side, Tim Lemmer on down low. Tim moves up to fourth in the 5X. Grayson continuing for that top spot, close battle going on. Bartell chopping away, coming after Smith for the lead. TJ by half a car length. Bartell charges into the 3-4 corner. And Chad Bartell, your new leader by a nose. What a tussle going on up front. Smith's fighting back down to the inside. Wants to get that lead back. We're winding down. We'll have a couple to go when we come by. Bartell, 13 and two remain. Down the back straightaway, the lead duo running away from the rest of the field. Here's the white flag, final lap. Through the one-two corner, the final time. The battle for third between Engels and Lemeron. Rookie Schneider into the top five in the 21S. Checkered flags in the air, it's Chad Bartell. 
taking the victory in the 81. Second to TJ Smith. Third to the 29 of Chris Angles. Tim Leveron unofficially to fourth. And the 21S of Steve Schneider. Your unofficial top five. Automotive Supply Company, IMCA Modified Feature. Jeremy Kemnitz, the rookie, your pull sitter. Jared Spaulding alongside the 22J. Jesse Crown in 55. Dan Canos, the Iron Man in the 22K. Give him a wave, give him a wave. There they are. Row number three, Frank Canos in the 24K. Jeff Wasinski in the 7Z. Row four, it's Lexi Ashcraft in the 42A. Steve Gaworski in 18. Wayne Morgan in the 14M. And Jerry Winkler driving the 08 tonight in row five. Row six, Jeff Youngworth, our point leader in the 12. Next to the 12X, so Steve Ecker. Jason Fairbank in the 13F. Patty Winkler in 23, making up row number seven. Row number eight, Chase Solomon in 33. Pat Clewitter, the wild child, 69X. Mark Schultz in the 70. Ricky Coffert in the 3K, making up the next row back. We're going racing. The rest of the field, Keith Olenek, Mike Niemer in his number five, Noah Poplin in his three. Charlie Ewald back there in his red number seven, Clint Evans in the 21. Oh boy, here we go again. Action galore, street stock style. Oh, Winkler had the 08 sideways in turn four. Oh, we got trouble over in turn four here at the back of the pack. Still going, got her going. Coffert gets her back on her way. Thanks, Ricky. Jeremy Kemnitz, your leader in the five. Down the back straightaway, Spalding there. Here comes the Iron Man, Dan Canals on the move in the 22K. Watch that bright orange machine working on up into the runner-up spot. They're four wide back here. Ecker in that 12 car trying to go way up around everybody. Oh boy, down the back straight over to watch that action for second place. And about there from out of the top five, look at him back there. Kron, Ecker, and the rest of the bunch. Look at them, three and four wide here again yet. Chemnitz in the five, continuing to lead. Canals in the second. Wisinski to third in the seven Z. Frank Canals in fourth. And here comes Ecker, the 12X, trying to get into the top five, and he's there. Running way up to that high line. Working hard up there. Aye, aye, aye. Lots of action back a little bit further. Oh, boy. Look at them all, mixing it up back here. Your leader by about three, four car lengths is still Chemnitz in the five. The 5K of Jeremy Chemnitz, a rookie out there. Won his heat earlier on and he's hanging tough, but here comes the Iron Man Canals. Bought to pick up one of those trophies that he co-sponsors. Watch that action for third. Ecker, Wisinski, and Frank Canals all going at it. Ewald in the red number 7E going to go a lap down to the lead battle very shortly. Oh, Dan Canals way up the racetrack in the one-two corner that time. Looked like the three of Poplin off the course. Or was that the 12 of our point leader? The point leader with problems into the pits. Oh my. Watch that battle for the top spot now. Dan Canals up to the high side. Wants that lead away from Chemnitz. And Ecker is there too. They're gonna go three wide for the lead.
Watch that 12X Ecker again. 021 of Evans off the pace here on the front stretch. Is he going to make it to pit road all right? He is wisely way up out of harm's way there, but caution on the course. 10 in, 5 to go. Through the one-two quarter down the back straightaway, Knaus, hanging tough, Ecker, coming up the challenge of the 12. Side by side through the three-four quarter, we'll have four to go. Oh, what a battle, oh, and Knaus is in trouble! Oh, the Iron Man! Oh, and he gets run into by Lexi and Patty. Oh, no. Dan Canals just driving hard, trying to stay with Steve Ecker there. And the car gets away from him in the one-two corner. How many of you think that Winkler's got something for the Ecker car? Or how about Jesse Cron? He's up there now. Let's see what happens. We're going back at it. Getting back at it. Here comes Frank Canals in the 24K down to the inside. Gaworski in the 18 making progress. Oh, this one's not over yet. We got three laps to go. Ecker way up to the high side, digging up there, and here comes Canals for the lead. Frank Canals down to the inside. His dad led for a while, and now Frank says, Dad didn't have any luck. I'm going to try to have good luck. Two laps remain, and who's going to do it? Ecker coming back. Gorski right there, too. Here comes Steve Gorski down to the inside of Knaus. Oh, he's down there almost inside of the tires. <laughs> oh, my. Something's going to give. It's going to do her in one more lap. Let's see what happens. Ecker back out front in the 12X. Knaus to the inside. Ecker to the high side. Gaworski wants to be part of it too. Winkler with a problem and heading to the pits. Here they are. Knaus giving it to Cole, trying to get the victory. Ecker, Knaus, who's going to do it? It's going to be Steve Ecker, Knaus, Gaworski, Wasinski, and Morgan. Holy cats. <laughs> oh my goodness. They'll wear this old geezer out up in the booth here an ounce of that kind of stuff. Holy smokers. All right, here they come, green flag. Hang on to it, hang on to it. Oh boy. Ay, 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 down the back straightaway, Josh Real leading them into the three, four corner for lap number one. Here comes the five of Wickman, Greg Wickman, the five. Oh, we got trouble in the one, two corner. All right, caution light goes down to just one lap in, 14 to go. Josh Reel's got some quick company coming. Let's see how things shake out here. Let's try to get some laps in. Green flag is flying right here. Here they go, and they're three wide. Oh, boy. Watch the two of Jerry Winkler. Thread the needle. Working on through there on the move. Greg Wickman out front, his number five. And it's Winkler, Heilman in the 99. Oh, and around goes Cosmo here on the front stretch. Getting her fired back up. Thanks, Cosmo. All right, we're going to keep going. Greg Wickman, your leader over Jerry Winkler. That's Dylan Heilman, Travis Van Stratton. 
public there in the 40. Lots of racing further back. John Hines being called for the caution earlier on. He's trying to work his way through heavy traffic right here. He's right there with Junior Karch and the rest of that bunch. We've got Andrew Becks up high here on the front stretch. Almost at a halt. Trying to keep it going. Up front, that's still a battle going on, challenging for that lead. Winkler wants the top spot. Caution on the course. Bex isn't going to make it back to pit road. A 13 lap feature for the Grand Nationals. A lap per car we're going to give them. We gotta get her in by the time limit. Let's do it. Back play action up front. Greg Wickman, your leader, and here comes Travis Van Stratton in the 2T. He wants that top spot. Winkler in third. Heilman fourth. Brumlick still hanging on to fifth at the 40B. Lap number seven. into the one two corner side by side for the top spot Wickman still strong down low trying to hold off a very determined Travis Van Strat here they come Wickman still with a slight edge to lap number nine Wickman Van Strat Winkler fourth place Brumlick Tom Brumlick in the 40B up to fourth and from the back of the pack after a spin back into the top five is a 57 of John Hines. <laughs> Winding down in this one. Keeping them going, keeping them going. Here comes the action up front. It's still Wickman in the five. Van Stratton still challenging hard there. We've got one setting in the one, two corner. Watch out, watch out, guys. Oh, boy. Eleven and four to go. Let's see how this one shakes out. Let's finish it up. Back at it, the battle, getting back, going up front. Van Stratton working hard on the five. A Wickman trying to get in there and take that lead away. Jerry Winkler hanging on to third. John Hines in fourth. The 99 of Dylan Heilman, your top five. We've got two laps to go. Ready to finish this one up. What flag will wave this time around? It's still the five of Greg Wickman coming to the white flag. He's got the two team of Van Stratton really putting the pressure on. 
He's put the pressure on, put the bumper to him in the second corner. Wickman says, go ahead, push me. I'll just go a little faster in front of you. Here comes the checkered flag. Who's going to do it? It's going to be Greg Wickman in the five, holding off Travis Van Stratton. Jerry Winkler to third. John Hines to fourth. The 99 at Dylan Heilman, your unofficial top five. to victory lane for a victory photo and a nice Kim Parsons Memorial Trophy. Oh wow, we're gonna keep on going here. One more race to go, faced out here by Bergstrom Awash, gosh, pace truck. Final event of the night. It's our Gold Star Racing Products Grand Nationals feature. Dan Cook in the 23, Derek Schross in 25, Don Schumacher in 55, Tim Doling in five, Tim Reichenberger in the 21, R. Brian Henry Hurricane in the seven. He's up and out of the car. Let's have a nice hand for him. A good run there for Greg Wickman. Row number four, Terry Van Roy in the zero nine. Kenny Richards in the nine. Rich Garvin, 44. Larry Richards in the 11 R. Team Beatty in the 79. Whoever we've got in that car tonight, they just say Team Beatty. Team Punas in the 77. A couple team cars. And Brad Lawson in the 51 at the back. 13 cars, 13 laps. Who's going to win it? We'll find out. Here we go. They're all going at it. Several of these drivers sponsoring the trophy tour, so they all want to take one of them nice big trophies home. Let's see how it shakes out. Reichenberger, Henry, Van Roy, the Richards boys, they all are sponsors of the trophy tour. Also, Beatty and Dion Wall, all sponsors of the trophy tour in this Grand National Division. Oh, and around goes Wall, or the Team 77 car. Team Punas, backwards in turn two. Gets back going, we'll stay racing. Don't stop, don't stop, don't stop. Oh, man. Gets the car going, pulls out and stops. Through the one two quarter, they're all in a bunch down the back straight away. Schroth in the 25, hanging tough. Here comes Larry Richards in the 11R. Watch Larry up to the high side, making some progress down to the inside. Comes Doling in the five car. Henry in the seven right there. Here comes Hurricane on the move in the seven H. Doling, Henry, Schroth, Richards. Reichenberger and Richards top six. Three wide through the one two corner down the back straightaway again. Hard charging racing going on. Oh, everybody racing hard for position. Look at them back here. Three wide going at it there. Brian Henry right on the heels of Tim Doling wants to get that lead. Doling in the five, not be denied. He leads to lap number six. Oh, we've got the 77 over here again. Oh, no! The 
77 car again giving some scary moments here that's a team car we don't even know who's behind the wheel it's called team punas Thanks again to our great friends from Total Power Sales for all they've done here for racing at Oshkosh Speed Zone and for bringing you tonight's racing action. This is probably going to be about the final restart because we're right at about at curfew here if we have any more issue. We have a very We have a very strict time limit here, so let's try to get seven more laughs in. Shh, we'll do it quietly. Nobody will even know. All right. Back at it we go. Tim Dolling out front. Brian Henry, the closest chaser. Kenny Richards right there alongside of his dad, Larry. Everybody working on around here. Another lap going in the books. Reichenberger, Schross back there side by side, battling for fifth. Terry Van Roy right there looking to move up as well. Watch that action up front. Brian Henry taking a peek to the inside of the five car. Oh, a little bit of contact there. They're working at it. Doling and Henry going at it. Oh, very close. Look at the action for the lead. Here comes Hurricane into the top spot. Brian Henry taking over now in the 7-H. Lap slipping away to lap number nine. Four to go. Brian Henry, now your leader over Tim Doling. Kenny and Larry Richards chomping at the bit there. Truck move up a little further before this one's over. 10 in. Left remaining. Down the back stretch they go another time. Battle is for second. Last green flag lap. Oh, and we've got caution on the course. The Team Beatty car now backwards over in turn two. Well, with that caution, as we said, we have a very strict time limit here now. And the cars will come around. The checkered flag will be displayed. And it's the Hurricane Brian Henry going to get the victory in the Gold Star Racing products. Grand Nationals feature. Time limit has expired. Curfew for us. Not the time limit on the race, but curfew here due to the uh, loud noises that we make for the neighbors.